You know, I have been reminded over the past, like about a year or so, through some teaching that I've heard, but also through some firsthand interactions that I've had personally, uh, that sometimes, not always, sometimes when people reject God, or more specifically when they reject Christianity, what they're rejecting is an incorrect view of God or Christianity. Now, I, I, hold on, I'm not saying that's always the case. I recognize some people understand the basic teachings of Christianity. They, they understand who Jesus is, and they really do reject Him. They, they, they really do. They know the truth about Jesus, and they reject Him anyhow. I, I get it. That happens. Got it. But, like I said, I've also I just I've been reminded that there are times when what people are rejecting is based on incorrect teaching. It's based on an incorrect understanding of the matter. In fact, sometimes when I hear what people are objecting to, I, I find myself thinking, well, I object to that also. I mean, I would object, I, I would reject that God or a faith that promoted those teachings. I get it. So, what this tells me is, to those of us who really are sincere and devoted followers of Jesus. It's important and it's very helpful for us to communicate the truth of Christianity. The truth of Christianity. Yes, we want to communicate lovingly. Absolutely. We want to, we want to do this gently and, and graciously. But we also want to communicate the teachings of the faith accurately. I guess part of what I'm saying here is this. Truth and accuracy matter.